I think I made a mistake guys. I was wrong to assume people on the internet, including some of my own subs were smart, smart enough to be able to watch my videos without the aid of a sarcasm detector. But sadly that isn't the case, so I guess in the future I'm going to have to hold your hands and wipe your ass with giant disclaimers at the beginning of every video, hell, maybe even throw one at the bottom of the video and keep it running throughout, just to get the damn point across. I just didn't think a disclaimer was really necessary for this top 5 worst abilities video because I already gave a shit ton of obvious hints everywhere, including one 5 seconds into the video which barely anyone gave a flying fuck about, does the rainbow comic sense with kindergarten spelling not strike you as unusual in any way, or not, is it completely normal and must mean this list is totally legit. It's kind of why I have a hard time understanding some people when they say it wasn't obvious enough for them. Shall I show you some more hints now? This guy says I'm totally serious about ability number 5, the absolute zero. Now I did mention some actual flaws about that ability like it not being able to pop balloons and shit, so fair enough I suppose, but I guess me saying the support Chinook was a popular tower flew over all your heads just like the Comic Sans text. I wouldn't say Absolute Zero is a garbage ability like this guy said, at least relative to other abilities. Did you ever stop to think that maybe, just maybe there are perhaps worse options you can put at number 5 instead of the Absolute Zero? Wait till you see number 4, where things get real face palmy. Honestly. It couldn't get any more obvious than this so if it didn't hit you by then, yes it would be worthwhile to invest in a sarcasm detector. The Blade Maelstrom, yeah dude Isub is definitely a fucking idiot who knows nothing about the game and how to place towers properly, that's probably why he has a shit win ratio and lost in the tournament right, oh wait. Let's hope it at least does something to Moab and Class Bloons, which we will test this by placing 7 blade maelstroms in the most optimal spot, which is under the trees in the shade, because shade helps prevent non-monkey towers from overheating as fast. Obvious hint number 3 right there boys, but yet again people are still too busy jacking off to Minecraft porn to even pay attention to what I'm saying. Maybe if you weren't doing that then you wouldn't have made such a fool of yourself. Let's not forget I brought up the lightning wizard also, you know once I put that joke of a tower in a positive light there's gotta be something up, but nope, totally normal for me to say lightning wizards are a great alternative to maelstroms. Just like the ice tower I will say the super monkey ability wasn't exactly the best option to tack onto the list, but still, after having said this. First off it can't even obliterate comma balloons, which is absolutely ridiculous, because without the tech terror upgrade, super monkeys can spot comma balloons just fine. There are absolutely no excuses for idiotic comments like this. But there's more guys, we still got people believing I'm legit all the way to number 2, where I make a completely fair comparison between triple dart monkeys and the fan club. And boy oh boy. It seems that everybody who made it through the video sarcasm detector free got most triggered from my number one worst ability choice, the ninja. Easily the most cancerous a comment section of mine has been since Kangra Reds, where we got a combination of people trying to reason to me the usefulness of the sabotage and others simply calling me an idiot. Seriously though, what do these people think I am, fucking brain dead? Keep in mind it isn't just the non-subs commenting shit like this, I can safely assume I got a boatload of idiocy from my own subs considering a lot of these comments were from the first day, so what's the deal with all this? Is it the only video of mine they watched or something, do they not realize I literally graduated at the top of my class in the balloons navy, not to mention I've been involved in numerous secret special missions in BTD5 and have over 300 completed daily challenges. All that and people still think I don't know the game in and out, SM fucking H. Let's end this off with a dumb comment to rule all dumb comments, one that actually critiques all 5 choices I made. This guy sure looks like he knows a lot, 
Let's check out his channel and see if we can learn a few tricks from him shall we? Ooh, a strategy video. Oh my god it's a late game one too, even better. Definitely looks like someone who knows his shit. I'm so jealous of his 50% win ratio that I can only dream of. Thank you for proving me wrong sir. So with that I'll see you all in the top 5 best abilities video. Make sure to bring your weapons cause we'll be exterminating some more dumb comments.